roll, baby, roll! <laughs> Arizona, and we are by the bridge. Well, it's actually from Glen Canyon, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's definitely. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and I just want to see the view, see, you know, you see the water behind us. Isn't it cool?
just arrived at Antelope Canyon. These are the vehicles that bring you there. You have to get there with a tour company and they have these vans and trucks that take you there. It's not a very glamorous ride. If you take one that's out in the open, like the one we were in, you're sitting on bench seats in the back of a pickup truck. It's open to the outside. It's very windy and very dusty because it's a lot of dirt road to get there. So be prepared for that. Have a mask to be able to breathe. Have eye protection to keep the dust out and the wind out. So this is the entrance to the lower canyon. There's an upper canyon as well. Some say the upper canyon is a lot prettier. We don't know. We have not been there. We've only been to the lower canyon. And it is very pretty in there. The guide, because you have to have a guide, they take a group of people, and your guide guides you through. They give you the history of the canyon. They also pick out the best spots to take photos. So they'll tell you where to stand. They'll take the picture for you with your phone or your camera to get the best picture. We didn't include any of those in there because for some reason in our pictures, we did not look so flattering. So we left those out. But these are pictures of inside the canyon. As you can see, it's very beautiful. It's created by floods that go through there. It just gets flash floods periodically. And over thousands and millions of years, it created these shapes and these colors. It's just beautiful. This is our ride back from the canyon. It was beautiful. We had a great time. Look directly in front of you on the mountain. It looks like a perfect heart. As far as I know, that's naturally made. And as I mentioned earlier, this is a dusty, windy part of the ride home. It's actually more like sand, like beach sand. There's cattle that run around out there. There's a cow on top of the hill. The sun is just starting to set over the mountain. It looks beautiful the way the shadows cast on the ground and on the mountains. You can't get enough pictures of that. This is a barbecue restaurant on the way to Antelope Canyon. They smoke their meat outside in this big huge smoker. And they have outside seating and live music as well. It's called Big John's and I highly recommend it. The next day we went to the Page Marina. That's a beautiful place. There's a couple of restaurants. They have outside seating with views of the water. So we decided to cross over to Utah and the drive was just amazing. Look at the rock formations. It's amazing how nature can just carve those rocks the way they are. So sit back, enjoy the view, and just appreciate nature's beauty of the earth. We came to the town of Wawi. We stopped at the visitor center, some dinosaur bones and skulls, and a lot of information about dinosaurs. It's really interesting in that visitor center there. So if you get a chance and you're out in that way, stop in and check it out. We went to the Warweep RV Park in Campground. That's a really pretty place. We didn't get many pictures of the park itself. We just went right to the water and just enjoy the views. It was so pretty out there. That was fun. It's time to go home. We had a great time. Enjoy the rest of the video and thanks for watching.